Hello, ladies and gentlemen, others, every person, thing, whatever, <laughs> you are welcome to Destiny Forsaken. Uh, today we are going to be continuing with our rampage through the barrens. Well, first of all, I didn't cover a couple things. One, our subclass, which I'm going to be trying to do when there's, we're actually fighting stuff, but our subclass is so amazing. I think... I haven't really messed around with the other ones, so I can't, I'm biased, of course, but this one just seems so, so good. If, if you have a, the opportunity, I would massively suggest this one. Not only is Blade Barrage an ins a stupid amount of damage, it scales incredibly well to where if you're far back and you, uh, you do, you activate it, it will spread itself out kind of thin, but it will massively disorient everyone, but if you're fighting the end strike boss or anything, you focus in on that one target, all of, like, the 50 knives that you throw will stack on top of that one person. There's no, like, damage reduction based on certain a person hit a number of times. That's not how it works. Um, it's insane. Like, you nuke down bosses that have half their health left. Uh, I can only imagine what two of these in sequence, what that looks like in at the end of a strike boss. Anyways, <laughs> the next thing is this. Knife trick. And this is why this is, like, single-handedly my favorite build that's worked in destiny and i've played a lot of hunter uh striker titan i played a titan on on ps4 anyways point being a dab with everything this one seems like one of the cooler abilities um not only is knife trick again massively scaled with damage so you throw three knives and when those three knives impact it's all of the damage of those three knives and if you get a little bit closer and you line up all three of them in someone's head instantly evaporated uh pri premium enemies get eviscerated instantly and here's the thing that they don't really elaborate on um is yes this is amazing and it applies a burn and then you have this one which is playing with fire where it's when you destroy a burning enemy it gives you one stack of playing with fire now what this one stack does is it recharges your blades it says more quickly it's fucking fast, like throw knives, one, two, three, throw knives, one, two, three, throw knives, and this stack of playing with fire lasts, it's like 15 seconds, so you can sh get a kill with a, with a burn dot on an enemy, which actually is quite hard to get, the knives already do it, so if you just hit a lesser tier enemy with your knife throw, this is proc'd, and you're gonna get your knife back that much faster, but you can get off like three knife, uh, three knife sets without having to kill a burning enemy, although usually you will, because <laughs> the knives are really overpowered in this instance. Um, and then you got this, which honestly, I feel like it's kind of a weird perk. I feel like these ones were already too strong the way they scaled it, so they added this. But it's when an enemy is burning, your dodge recharges faster, which is great for some of the exotics, such as the one that gives you health regeneration, as well as a ton of armor, as well as a ton of base health. Great helmet. Don't know what it's called. <laughs> Forget at the moment. But this is amazing. It's super strong. Everything is fantastic. But... The burn dot is kind of iffy. Uh, the burn dot can be attained via this grenade, but it can't be attained via this grenade, which is pretty shitty. Uh, and this one's kind of annoying to proc, but also I use this one anyway just because it's good grenade. But also, yeah. <laughs> Anyways, yeah, catch the enemies on fire, yeah. Uh, but I thought maybe there's a chance that, like, a, a gun could set an enemy on fire that is a fire gun. No, that's not how it works. Uh, but I do think Cades, uh, which is funny, I think this specific Lodo goes really in hand with Cade's last word gun because when you get a head it's a kinetic weapon that when you get a headshot explodes in a fire it has firefly so that will set an AOE boom to everyone around them getting a fire dot burn kill potentially I'm not sure if that's gonna happen maybe it's just like an explosive because they need to be burning and then you kill them so there's kind of like a counter thing there uh, but Oh my god, is this, is this subclass just amazing? Can't wait to show you guys it. Also, one quick thing. Um, last time, I was under the impression that when you look at these levels, it says recommended power one uh, 410. Quite a little bit. I was looking at stuff like this, and I was like, oh my god, recommended power 420. Is that a weed thing? Yeah, it's a weed thing. Anyways, <laughs> um, nothing, 40, all this stuff. Oh, that one's actually 440. Anyways, point being... Is that I seen a lot of this stuff and I was like, God damn. Uh, apparently, I, uh, I'm i not prepared for any of this. But I, I heard people beat it in one day. <laughs> so I'm kind of like, what? So I feel like either people just grind their face off or these are just not as bad as I'm thinking they are. And I imagine they do have a, a more intense equivalent like we mentioned in the past video. But yeah. 
Um, also, my god, dude, there's so many little tiny things that I could talk about for ages, like the fact that they're massively pushing bounties. <laughs> so much. So many bounties that give you power gear, such as this one, but I have to wear... Or this one, which I have to wear a full strike set, but I don't even have any of that, so... Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, I don't know. But, uh, yeah, tons of stuff that I'm just like, Ooh. <laughs> Can't wait. Also, uh, real quick thing before we go kill this boss. Uh, if we go to uh, collection tab, sorry, and we go down to uh, our, our new hunter exotics, some of these look unbelievably badass, and I hate it because a lot of them aren't for my... There's no, like, gunslinger, knife thrower thing, unfortunately. <laughs> it's, it's shitty. Um, I think there's one, but it's an old one that kind of still plays with the idea of it, but I'm not sure if it actually applies it. Anyways. Point being, mwah, this looks awesome in metal as fuck, and it's all for the, of course, Void Blade Dancer thing, which makes me depressed and sad, but this one is kind of for the Hunters, it looks, it doesn't look great in my opinion, but it's uh, got double knives, grants two knife per charge, which is insane for us, considering we regenerate our stuff, oh, but this one, this one just looks amazing, I think, on a passive level, but guess what it's for, oh yes, the blades, <laughs> the blade kill restores, yeah, yeah, <laughs> it looks like super, oh, <laughs> god, fucking shit, uh, it looks so much like, of course, it's got the Japanese aesthetic, but it reminds me of Dragon Ball Z, <laughs> I don't know why, it just does, wicked though, Wh I want it, I probably will never get it, but, you know, whatever, all right, <laughs> next Baron, by the way, uh, so much destiny coming at you guys, uh, and yeah, I realize some people are not all about it, but me, Kind of all about it. Uh, but my game plan is actually to get to the max rank, which is 50. 50, uh, or sorry, 500 is the stasis amount. So that's the maximum amount we can attain uh, before none of the gear starts dropping at higher level. That's when we need to start farming resources that specifically give us engrams of powerful gear engrams. That's when we're going to need to start farming them when we get to 500. And I'm so, so close to 500. Um, also, we got this gun. It's the I got it when I was playing Gambit. Um... And I looked at it, and I, I, my heart just swelled to a beautiful swell. <laughs> um, and I was like, dude, this looks awesome. It looks like a Western six-gun. I love these things to pieces in the real world. I think they're, like, the coolest thing. But, uh, yeah. So, the base weapon is bad. Like, really bad. It's supposed to be, I mean, it kind of fits the whole, like, handgun that this is trying to persuade, I think. But, yeah, it has, like, no recoil. And it doesn't have a big magazine, so like I'm kind of, I'm kind of sad about it. It does have outlaw, so we can reload really fast. But its magazine is trash, <laughs> so I'm kind of like, eh, I love the look of it so much, and it, and it, it's got glowy bits on it. But God help me if it's probably not strong. <laughs> but enough chit chatter. Let's jump into uh, killing one of the bandits that took our dear friend. In reality, it was just the one guy, really. Actually, it was just uh, what's his name, King Aldrin, but. Whatever. Avenge Kate's death by crossing the Scorched Baron, uh, known as Trickster, off your list. The Trickster, let us begin. This glimmer is encrypted with a signature. Araskis, the Trickster. She's a coward who hides behind traps and flunkies. Bet we can find an informant somewhere around here. Ooh. Well, we never really talk to any of our enemies. We just kill them before they have a chance of telling us that they have a family so that we feel less bad about ourselves. It's kind of real dark, but you know. Why, hello! Wow, you are surprisingly weak. It's oh. To blow. If a shipment of these rigged engrams ever made it to the last city, we can't let that happen. Every guardian would be like, oh my god, yeah, boom, dead, 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 <laughs> How to wipe out every guardian on the face of the earth. Uh, well, you see, you just tangle loot that's actually a bomb. <laughs> it's, it's, it's genius, but horrifying. Alright, I gotta climb some. Got it. There we go, maybe. Yes, good. Oh, thank god there's a grapple. Ooh, look at these. Well... Give me all these engrams. I keep fucking missing because I can't estimate for shit. All right, boom! Did it? <laughs> oh no! It found our factory of delights. If only we planned for this. <laughs> 
That's the trickster. Gotta be. Good news? The Engram fabricators are destroyed, and I traced the source of the trickster's broadcast. Bad news? The trace was way too easy for someone called the trickster. Got it. <laughs> so, most likely a death trap. Got it. Love them. We're used to them <laughs> at this point. Uh, have I reached rank 50 yet? Oh, I have. Oh, my God. Oh, my, oh my God. We did it. Why did why did why could it just left the other way? <laughs> what the hell is your problem, game? I didn't have to walk all the way around. Boom! Meant to do. <laughs> well, you see, Guardian, uh, it's I, way too easy. So, uh, only lead we have. So let's go walk into a trap. No, nope, it's not a bear trap. Just like one of those things that captures like this tiny wildlife, like a stick in a, in a box. <laughs> yeah, in a rock. Welcome, minion of G. She's rigged the ammo too. Oh, and you're Im immune. How incredibly unfun. Oh, check this out. Boom! Double kill, and guess what? My knife's gonna come back in a, a couple seconds. Just give me a minute. And it, it has to stack more, and then it'll become more violently uh, recharging. So, like this. Nope! Oh, I might lose my stacks. There we go. So we got three stacks. And boom, 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 boom. We have another knife. Ba-bam. We, we can just keep that going. And we just keep get our knives all the goddamn time. Boom, another knives. It's going to come back. It's fine, guys. It's amazing. This ability is the best. Especially if you happen to just love knife throwing. Boom. Give me more of my knives. And more knives. Oh, that's a trickster. Oh, it's fine because we have that on a uh, cooldown thing. What? What? I don't know. <laughs> Hi. Oh, I, yeah, I lost it. I lost and I just threw my grenade. Oh, no, I somehow got it. What? I somehow retained my knife throwing uh, juice, <laughs> whatever it's called. Oh, damn it. Didn't estimate it properly, but you see 9,000 on a headshot. And that's one or I think it was two of the knives impacting. Just crazy. You nuke down something incredibly fast. I love this ability. I can't even wait to show you guys the damage it does. Oh. Okay. You got me. <laughs> you got me, trickster. You piece of shit. When you when someone like a trickster is only good as as your your faith in them. Look how much damage that did. That was was an, an elite. Fucking hell yeah. Fucking Titan Doom Keeper Hammer, although it is pretty fucking sick, but you know. I was complaining about this knife, but maybe it's just some enemies are trash. See, like, this would be the kind of weapon that I would love if it was just all precision damage. Like, if you didn't get a headshot, it was trash. <laughs> I would love that if there was a weapon like that. But still had that fast fire rate, so you could just, like, nuke down people incredibly quickly. If you all wanted. Should we try to end this very quickly? Let's see. No, she'll just walk away. Okay. No, we do have to uh, kill all these people, though. We want to go deeper. We'll have to blast our way in. We'll have to blast our way in. Yeah, I could have maybe nuked her down there, but I don't know. Maybe this gun will be useful if you get, like, the perfect, perfect roll on it. But it doesn't do enough damage, so you need all the damage rolls. No! Ooh! Oh, fuck are you? <laughs> ba bam! Ooh, look at this! <laughs> it wants revenge! Yes, we deserve it! Here is some ammo for you! <laughs> Alright, so check this out. She's pretty weak, right? And is she gonna do some sort of. Yeah, she is. So that was. She just doesn't have a lot of health on a passive level, so this is not the best example. Look at that. <laughs> Two barons down, six to go. Then Aldrin. Is that a special... That might be a special thing. Let's see. Is that specifically a... That doesn't look like it's a... The, like the Wild West equivalent, right? Trickster destroyed. Okay, well this is kind of cool. She has like glimmer chunks and piles. Because <laughs> you just seem like a thief. That's kind of awesome. Yes, yes, we did it. I forgot I had this emote. But yes, look at all the beautiful flowers throwing... Thrown my way. It becomes a huge pile and it's just... Glorious. Yeah, Scorched Baron Vest. Okay, so there is special gear. <laughs> it's amazing. Okay, so there is special gear drops. 
<laughs> it's awesome. Um, unless, unless this is also called, no, it's called something else. I think this is just the base, kind of like Nomad helmet. But this looks impossibly sick. <laughs> is there a full armor set for each boss? Probably not. I think, like I said, it probably was just one piece. But, uh, what is it offer us? Unflinching light arm aim. Reduces flinching from oncoming fire while aiming sidearms, hand cannons, bows, and submachine guns. That is unbelievably sick. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, and increases the drop chance on primary ammo for kill. That's perfect. That's exactly what I want because uh, I plan to use Cade's gun and Cade's gun is good. So good. Uh, but no, that is just, just uh, perfect. Just so, so good. Anyways, uh, guys, th these um, barons are probably going to be pretty fast because, again, I... I thought we had to be the appropriate light level, but I did not know... Well, one, we are playing, I think, the best damage subclass in the game. Whether people like to play it is something else. Uh, I don't know. I really like the, like, knife throwing and the fact that we have such a heavy emphasis on damage. And with, with the fact that burning enemies give us back our roll faster and getting our knives back, which give us tons of damage, this can make up for the lack of defense that we have. Uh, because every time we dodge, we gain... What is it again? Small amount of health as well as a shield bump. So that, that gives us base resistance as well as health. And I think it gives you regeneration. Uh, so you start recovering health as well. Uh, and it's just so good. And again, um, I think there's only one weapon. Or there's weapons that can give you like a burn effect. And that is the uh, dragonfly perks. Uh, and yeah, I cannot wait. I cannot fucking wait. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to sweep this mess up, sweep all this filthy glimmer up. If you do, support the channel. Thank you kindly. If you just watch these videos, you're equally as fucking amazing. Uh, because, frankly, the Destiny videos are always a niche on my channel. No one really likes them, <laughs> but I sure, I sure as hell love making them. So those of you guys who do watch, I love you to pieces. Subscribe button above me. Two videos to my right. Thank you kindly, and goodbye.